My one big thing in this game is which one of these quarterbacks will come up big in the fourth quarter? Cam Ward, Graham Mertz, because I don't know about you. I'm expecting kind of like this line expects Mm -hmm. this thing to be tight throughout. And then also you got to take into account some of the history with these head coaches too. Yes. Uh, Mario Cristobal, Billy Napier. Uh, which one of these might make a mystifying in-game decision <laughs> yeah. at some point? If you're a Florida fan, I think you can take a little bit of solace that even if you're down in the fourth quarter, we've seen with Mario mm-hmm. at either Oregon or Miami last year, ask Georgia Tech for more about that. Um, it can get a little dicey with Mario uh, late in games. Oh, yeah, absolutely. And to try my one big thing here is – um, uh, at the end of the game, I think if you look at how many yards uh, Damian Martinez gets, uh, the new addition to that running back room at Miami, I think that's going to tell us a lot. Martinez, uh, certainly last year, the transfer from the Pac-2, shall we say, uh, getting over a thousand yards. And look, I get the competition is different than the SEC, but there's two things here: is it, it's going to be um, Cam Ward throwing the ball, and can they keep him contained? And how much help is Martinez going to be able to to get it, give him? And I'm sure his pops would probably say too, Trev, how how much improved. Is that Gator defense going to be, uh, if they can stop the run or at least slow it down, that's going to be huge for the Gators. Yeah, there's been a lot of consternation with Gator Nation about the play calling duties with Billy Napier handling that. But Mm -hmm. you're right. A couple of things. If the defense isn't better and special teams. Yes. uh, It it may not matter as much. So, uh and also, you know, you wonder too for Florida the availability of Montreal Johnson. Absolutely. At the running back position.